Hi, it's Hannah and today I'll be showing you five really fun designs that you can do for Halloween, so let's get started. Starting off, I'll be applying a base coat to all of my nails. For the first design, I'll be doing some cute candy corns. I'm going to use white, orange, and yellow acrylic paint with a sparkly purple as my base color. Using the white acrylic paint and a brush, I'm going to outline the candies first and then fill them in. Next, I'll be filling in the bottom part of the candy with the yellow acrylic paint. And now fill in the middle with the orange paint, leaving white at the top. Next up is a skull design. I'll be using black and white polish with white as my base color. You can definitely use black acrylic paint for the details. I normally would, but I guess I kind of forgot. I don't know what happened there, but yeah, you can use either one. Using the black polish, I'm going to create a line that curves around and down on each side of the nail. And then I'll be filling in both sides. I'll be connecting each side with a straight line and then I'm going to add in smaller little vertical lines for the teeth. Two dots will be added for the eyes and then a rounded triangle shape for the nose. The third design is a black cat, but it also kind of reminds me of Toothless from How to Train Your Dragon, but anyways, I'm going to use black polish and yellow acrylic paint. Use the black polish to create a circle at the tip of your nail, or a half circle if your nails are more square. Now add in some pointy ears on each side. Add two dots of yellow acrylic paint for the eyes. And now add in the center of the eye with the black polish. Next up, we have an alien design. I'll be using green polish and black acrylic paint with the green as my base color. With the paint, I'll be creating angled almond shapes for the eyes. And then I'll be adding two tiny lines for the nose and then a smile. And last but not least, we have a matte blood design. I'll be using black and dark red polish with black as my base color. I'm going to apply a glossy top coat. This will give it a nice smooth surface for the perfect matte finish. Once it's dry, apply the matte top coat. I'll be adding dots of dark red polish first and then connecting them to the rest of the blood that's coming from the cuticle. And finally, apply a glossy top coat except for the pinky design, of course. Alright, so that does it for this video. I really hope you enjoyed it. Be sure to find me on social so you can tag me all your nail or nail art pictures. I'd love to see them. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you later. Bye!